All right, adventurers. Oh, it's Wednesday. <laughs> All right, adventurers. Welcome to All Play. Uh, we're back. We're going to do us a little bit more, just a little bit more of our, our new solo adventure, our new solo expansion. Dr. Boom's The Boom's Day Project. We're going to go into the puzzle lab. All right, now we have we have one more full wing to do. And then we have, I guess, the final versions of every single one of the wings. All right. So with that said, let's begin survival. Come one, come all to the spectacular boomatorium. All right. So I guess it's not going to give me a hint on what I need to do. I'm going to assume survival means I need to survive the next turn. I need to set it up so I live through the next turn. Uh, the fuse is lit. Heal to full health before it's too late. Okay. This going to be good. This going to be good. Yeah. Okay. So the goal is to survive the boss's hero power. Uh, we will see our hero power in just a minute. This is Boom Nish and Brina. Are you a new test subject? I will light the fuse. Mm okay. We're testing out some fireworks in here. On your face. Try and survive, yeah? Oh, this is going to be such fun. Well, I guess I need to heal to full health. That That's the thing. Okay, so I just need to make it a full health. Okay, so what have we? Boom Nish and Brina has nothing on her side of the battlefield. And her hero power says heal to full health to survive this experiment. We have 10 health, 9 mana, no cards in our deck. And we're paladins. So our hero power is summon a 1-1 one, one silver hand recruit. Cards in our hand, we have forbidden healing. Uh, spend all your mana. Restore twice that much health. That's for zero. But now nah, I spend all my mana. And then we have holy light. Restore 6 health. So clearly, I think I'm going to drop Holy Light on myself for six. Block add all those colors? Holy Light on myself for six. So that brings me to 16. And then that spends two mana, so I'd have seven left. If I spend Forbidden Healing with seven uh, mana, it's going to heal me for 14. So 60 plus 14 is 30. <sighs> Boom! Okay, so the fireworks deal 29 damage. We have to make it a full health to live. Okay. I shouldn't say full health. It's probably going to be... No fun if you were at full health. We need to keep things exciting. It, it's, it probably... I shouldn't say full health. I need to be able to prevent 29 points of damage. That's probably what it is. Okay. So, Breen, the side of the board, she has the Flame Wreath Faceless. It is a 7-7, seven, seven, but it's already been damaged for two points, so it's a 7-5. Uh, our side of the board, we have the Deranged Doctor. Uh, an 8-8 eight, eight with Death Rattle Restore. 8 health to your hero. Uh, we're Priest, and we're at 10 health. Our, he our hero ability is uh, Restore 2 health. No cards in our decks. We ha I have three cards in hand. The first is Binding Healing. For one mana, I can restore 5 health to a minion in my hero. Flash heal, I can restore five health. Outrun it. Restore five health for one mana. And I have Holy Smite deal two damage uh, for one mana. So I can do everything. I can attack with the doctor. I can play every spell in my hand. And I can use my hero ability. Uh, I think what I need. Let's see. Binding health. I can't play this unless unless there's a minion for it to uh unless there's a minion for it to hit. But if I play this on my deranged doctor, it's not gonna die this turn. So what I need to do is play binding help, uh, binding heal, on the on the on the, this thing. So now when I attack the doctor, I attack with the doctor, they'll both die. Meaning this will heal me for eight. And then if I hit myself with flash heal. And then lesser heal. I'm at 30. 
It seems like the goal is to make it to 30. Make it to 30 health, and then I'm done. You never know when some of these minions might come in handy. All right, bring the side of the board. She has the corrupted heal bot, a 6 6 that reads Death Rattle, restore 8 health to the enemy hero. Uh, we're Paladin, so our hero ability is summon a 1 1 Silverhand recruit. There's no cards in either of our decks, and my hand from left to right is equality for 2. Uh, change the health of all minions to 1. Then I have 2 copies of Holy Light, restore 6 health. Those both cost 2 mana. Uh, Seal of Light, restore 4 health to your hero and gain 2 attack this turn. And then True Silver Champion is a weapon, uh, a 4-2 weapon that says whenever your hero attacks, restore 2 health to it. Okay. We have 10 mana. Uh, we're not going to be able to play what everything. If I light this fuse? We're not going to be able to play everything. Okay. So if I drop equality on the heal bot, I can attack it. How much is it going to give me? 8. If I attack it with the True Silver Champion... Actually, maybe I shouldn't do that. Maybe I should use the True Silver Champion. That's four. And the Seal of Light. That's going to heal me for a total of six when I attack. I'll be able to kill this, which is going to undo that six, and then give me eight once it dies. So I'll be at 18. Then these two are 12. That's perfect. Seal of Light. So that's four points, and me attacking is going to give me two more health. Uh, so it's going to put me at 16 and then attacking that's going to take it all right away. Justice. But it's going to die and heal me for eight. So now I just need 12 points. That's both of these holy lights. Dope. Try not to fire him off before you're ready. All right. Uh, Brina side of the field. She has a corrupted heal bot. That's a 6-6 six, six that reads death rattle restore 8 health to the enemy hero. But he's got an extra point of attack thanks to the dire wolf alpha. So he's really a 7-6 right now. Uh, again, the dire wolf alpha is giving adjacent minions uh, plus 1 attack. And it's normally a 2-2. Two -two. The dire wolf alpha is a 2-2. Two -two. Then we have the mistress of mixtures. A 2-2 two -two with Death Rattle, restore 4 health to each hero. Again, it's getting a plus 1 attack from the Direwolf Alpha, so it's a 3-2. Our side of the field, we have a Silverhand Recruit, a 1-1. One -one. Uh, there's no cards in either of our decks, and we're Paladins, so our hero ability... One. Glad I am not taking the hit. Our hero ability is summon a 1-1 one -one Silverhand Recruit. Uh, our cards from left to right. We have Equality, change the health of all means to 1. Uh, two copies of Holy Light, restore six health. And then we have the True Silver Champion weapon. It is a 4-2 that says whenever your hero attacks, restore two health to it. Okay. Uh, we only have eight mana this time. I'm thinking if I play quality, if I play equality, everybody's going to have one health. I can attack the Dire Wolf Alpha. No. I leave the alpha. Oh, yeah, I got to get rid of the alpha, don't I? Yeah, I have to get rid of the alpha. Could we strap some fireworks to that minion? If I play quality. What if I play a quality and attack the heal bot with my my recruit? I'll heal for 8, so I'll be at 18. This is going to restore 4 health to each hero. 18 if I get four health if I attack it I'm gonna get two and then if I attack it I'm gonna get a total of six but he's gonna take three from me 18 is uh six so it's only gonna it's only gonna give me three that'd be 21 this would put me at 27 and then I'd be out of mana Double the gunpowder. Let me see. I want to get rid of the alpha because that extra point, that one point doesn't matter that much. I'm still down two, even if I get rid of that one point. 
Let's experiment here. Let's experiment a little bit. Change the alpha to everybody. Eighteen. Oh, I'm dumb. Eighteen. I attack here, and then I just use both the holy lights. Same as last time. We're using Paladin much more than I expected we would. Okay. Uh, bring aside the field. It's the same thing as last time. Uh, the Corrupted Heal bot. It's a 6-6 six, six with Death Rattle Restore. He held to the enemy hero, uh, but he's being boosted by the Dire Wolf Alpha. And so is the Mistress of Mixtures. A 2-2 two, two with Death Rattle uh, Restore for health each hero. Okay. Our side of the board is also the same. We have one Silver Hand Recruit, a 1-1. One, one, with no cards in hand. No, I'm sorry. No cards in our deck. We're a... Paladin with 10 health. Our hero ability is summon a 1-1 one, one Silver Hand Recruit. Our cards in our hand from left to right. Forbidden Healing. Spend all your mana. Restore twice that much health. Crystal Smith. Kangor. A 1-2 with di uh, Divine Shield and Lifesteal. How does Flark add all those colors? As well as the ability, your healing is doubled. So anytime we would heal, instead we'll heal twice as much. Uh, equality. Change the health of all minions to 1. Seal of Light, restore four health to your hero and gain two attack this turn. And then the True Silver Champion, a 4-2 weapon with Renever, your hero attacks, restore two health to it. Okay. We have seven mana, so let's get to work. Seven mana. If I play this. This. That's it. That's the answer, isn't it? <laughs> if I play Crystal Smith Kangor, it's going to double my healing. I can then play Forbidden Healing, which is normally going to give me twice as much mana, but instead it's going to give me four times as much mana. I'll have five left after I play Kangor. So four times five is 20. 20 plus 10. That's the answer right there. I wonder if there's an actual way to do this one with these. I feel like I feel like if that one would have been the one that had, had multiple ways to solve it. All right, bring the side of the board, empty. Our side of the board, empty. Uh, we're a priest, so our hero ability is, I'm sorry, we're a priest with 10 health. Our hero ability is restore to health. Both of our decks are empty. And my cards in hand, from left to right, I have two copies of Flash Heal, restore five health. I have one Radiant Elemental, a 3-2 Elemental that says your spells cost one less. I have one Shadow Word Pain, destroy a minion with three or less attack. I have one Auction Master Beardo. Uh, three four that says after you cast a spell refresh your hero power and then I have one priest of the feast a three six that reads whenever you cast a spell restore three health to your hero ten mana let's work uh priest of the feast is looking pretty 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 Think you could outrun it? uh let's start there I feel like we can draw start there I have a total of three spells in hand so at best the three spells are going to trigger this for nine points total. Not counting what Flash Heal is going to do. That's actually going to be ten. Ten from both of these. So that's 19 if I could drop Priest of the Feast and then all the spells in my hand. So let's start there. Blessed be this cake. If I play Radiant Elemental, I can drop these two for free and then this costs one. Then I can play Auction Master Beardo. Uh, actually, I don't think I need him. I won't be able to afford my hero power. Unless I need a target for Shadow Word Pain. I, I actually think that's it. He's my target. Time is money, friend. Okay, so let's start with Shadow Word Pain on Auction Master Beardo. It's a spell, so it's going to heal me for three. Then we can cast Flash Heal on myself. It's going to heal me for three. And then it's going to be its normal five. And then the same thing again with flash heal. Is that going to make it? Eight? No, nah, I'm one point short, aren't I? I'm one point short. Huh. In a death. In a death. That did not work. Okay. Okay. 
Let me see. Okay, here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. Priest of the Feast. Blessed be this king. Auction Master Beardo. Nah, this isn't gonna work. I was gonna say this, then this. But now we're out of mana. Who cares if we can use our hero ability again if we can't pay for it? Alright, let's see. How about Priest of the Feast? Radiant Elemental. If we're two points short or two mana short, let's not play Auction Master Beardo. Let's heal. Then we'll drop flash heal on ourselves. Then we'll drop flash heal on ourselves. There we go. And now we hit our uh we hit one of these two. Yeah, either one, doesn't matter. We hit one of the, actually I think it does for timing. We can't hit this with Shadow Word Pain. Actually it probably doesn't. The way that just happened, it probably didn't matter. There we go. I always enjoy patching myself up. After a long day at work. All right. Bring the side of the board. We have the Mistress of Mixtures, a 2-2 that reads Death Rattle. Restore four health to each hero. Our side of the board, we're empty. We have 10 health and we're Shaman. Our hero ability has been used, but in case we need it, it's Summon a, a Random Totem. Our hand, oh, empty decks. Nobody has anything in their deck. Our hand from left to right, we have Lightning Bolt. Deal through damage and overload one. Ancestral Spirit, give a minion Death Rattle. Resummon this minion. Reincarnate, destroy a minion, then return it to life with full health. Healing Wave, restore 7 health, reveal a minion in each deck. If yours costs more, restore 14 instead. Tidal Surge, deal 4 damage to a minion, restore 4 oh, health to your minion. Fireworks to that minion. I'm sorry, restore 4 health to your hero. And then Jinyu, Water Speaker, a 3-6 that reads Battle Cry, restore 6 health, and overload 1. Uh, we have 10 mana. This one's actually going to be fun. Okay. So let's see. We could destroy the Mistress of Mixtures with Reincarnate and bring it right back to health. So that's four health already. We can hit it. Actually. What if we hit it with Ancestral Spirit first? That will give it Death Rattle, resummon this minion. Reincarnate's going to destroy it and return it to full life. And then our ancestral spirit's gonna make a second one in play. Let's just be cool with it. What happens <laughs> if I light this fuse? Let's just be cool with it. So it's gonna die here. Give me four health, and then there's gonna be two copies of it. I don't think it matters that I make two copies. Uh, I can then hit it with, let's see, it's gonna die and bring us a 14. Then I can hit one of the two with a lightning bolt. That'll br uh, kill it. And then bring us to, let's see, four more health. That'll bring us to 18. And then we don't have one copy, so we stop being cool. Oh, uh, we need 12 health. I guess we can healing wave. Actually, 12 health. 12 health is only one way to pull it off, isn't it? Oh, the, oh. This is a tough one. Glad I am not taking the hit. Okay, let's do this. So when it dies, it's going to come back by itself. And then this is going to bring it to full health. So we're going to have two copies. Side effects. Side effects. No. Trust me. Trust me. That's what I wanted to hear. <laughs> I knew it was going to say that. Okay. Uh, deal four damage to a minion. Restore four health to your hero. So if I kill one of them, it's going to actually give us eight health. Putting me at... Let's see, eight. Six, that's, is that it? That's not it. 
Eight total, not eight together. Okay. Now, if I hit this, oh, shoot, I'm only at 26. I'm only at 26. Oh, I was trying to be cool. Okay, let's see. All it takes is a spark. If I resummoning it, resummoning water Jinyu isn't going to trigger battle cry twice, will it? Let's find out. Wait, that's not how math works, Chill. That's not how math works. Let's find out. Let us give it another go. Oh, now we have our hero power for some reason. Whatever. It's not going to let me use it. Let's see if this works. Nope. Nope, didn't heal me over, and that's okay. Not really, but you know. If it went boom in your face right now, yeah, let us restart. Okay. What am I not abusing the right way? What am I not abusing the right way? Okay. If I kill this, let's see. How many times do I need to kill this <laughs> to make it a 30? I need to kill this five times. Can I kill this card five times? This is one. This is two. This is three. But then I'm out of mana. Okay, so killing this, and then I'm actually even out of ways to kill it over and over. So killing this five times... All those colors. It's not the option. Hmm. Villa minion in each deck. There's nothing in there. So this is really just heal seven. Okay. Okay, let's start with this. This is more mana efficient, isn't it? To kill it this way. Because this is just going to give us four health. This is going to give us four health and one mana. This is going to give us twice as much health, but cost a lot more mana. Than twice as much. Mm -mm. Store the full health. I'm trying to figure out how to kill. How's the right way to kill this thing? Mm -mm. Right. And then heal me for seven. Uh, so now I need nine mana. I'm sorry, I need nine health. This is eight. If I kill that, that's eight. Ugh, this game. This game sometimes. No. Trust, Trust me. me. Alright. If at first you do not succeed. Okay. I feel like it's something with Jinyu Water Speaker. Let's see what we're going to do. What are we going to do? Villa Mania in each deck. I, I want that 14 so bad. I want that 14 to be it. Okay. Uh... 
Oh shoot! I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm I'm lost here. How do I get twenty points of health with this? Think you could outrun it. And this hand. If I play this, I'm severely limiting the rest of my rest of my plays. Kill that. No. That wasn't it. I was supposed to heal. Heal myself. Let's see. I just healed for four right there with that move. I'm sorry. I healed for eight. I healed for eight total. I should have did healing wave and then lightning bolt on one of them. Damn it. Damn it. Ah, I think I saw it. I think I saw it. Okay. Would it hurt to try again? Okay, ancestral spirit. Reincarnate. Trust me. Trust me. Now if I heal myself for seven. That puts me at 21. Then I shoot that. Oh, that's not right. That's not right. That's the answer. If I get rid of that for eight, that's 22. No, that's still not the answer. That's what I did last time, isn't it? Yeah. I think that's just what I did last time. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm closer. I'm getting closer. If it went boom in your face right now, yeah, let us restart. Okay, let's try this. That there. I want a tidal surge, healing wave, and lightning bolt. Tidal surge. That's going to put me at 29, isn't it? I'm going to be pissed off. 18 and 7 is 25. And then this there, yeah, it puts me right at 29. Now I'm mad. <laughs> now I'm mad. It shouldn't be healing. It shouldn't be the other four cost. It should be Jinyu. Now I'm mad. It's, it's, it's not even this, is it? It's Jinyu. Ancestral spirit. Ancestral, no. Ancestral spirit doesn't matter. It's reincarnate. That's going to kill and give me four, put me at 20. This will put me at 27. This will put me at, uh. If I kill it again, if I kill it again, that put me at 30 or 31, but you know, damn it. There it is. There it is. Man. <laughs> Man. All right, we're uh, we're fighting Brina. Brina has nothing on her side of the board, and neither do we. We're a priest with 10 health. Our hero ability is restore to health. There's no cards in Brina's side of the, uh, Brina's deck, but we have three cards in ours. Our cards in hand, we have Radiant Elemental, a 3-2 that says your spells cost one less. We have Shadow Visions, discover a copy of a spell in your deck. So these three must all be spells, and I have to pick the right one. 
Uh, this is Auction Master Biro at 3-4 that says after you cast a spell, refresh your hero power. And then two copies of Priest of the Feast whenever you cast a spell, restore three health to your hero. A 3-6. Okay. Um, I'm going to guess... If I light this fuse? I'm going to guess A, we need Priest of the Feast. And B, we only need one. Unless all three of these are free spells, and and I doubt that. Let's let's see. Blessed be this cake. And then if I play Radiant Elemental, I can then cast Shadow of Visions for one less. Uh, so let's see. That's two. This would be three. I'd have three mana left, and then I can pull the right quote unquote right card from our deck. Watch watch the rest of these be Shadow Visions. <laughs> Or, or watch these three. We're discovering a copy, so we're not taking it out of our deck. Watch its Shadow Visions. How would I know? The right... Oh. Yes. We pull Shadow Visions a total of three more times. If we take a, a copy of Shadow Visions three more times, and then that last time we take Flash Heal. That's the trick. We're discovering a copy. We're not taking it out of our deck. Again. And because we're not taking it out of our deck, we can pull it out. We can we have the same options over and over. So this time we'll do Shadow Visions and now we pull Flash Heal, which we'll be able to cast for free. This isn't gonna make it. Five. Oh yeah, five and three. I thought it was five and two. That's eight total. Yeah. Did it. Next in line, me. Oh, that was it. That's pretty dope. That was that was that was a challenge and a half, I will say. That was not simple. Are we gonna okay, I'll just say we're gonna just hang out here. Alright, we got the next level of survival. Oh, ooh, this is <laughs> I'm getting that mental workout, boy. Okay, if you guys enjoyed this video and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. Now that subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way you get notified whenever a video gets posted to the channel. Or whenever we do something special like Dr. Boom's The Boom's Day Project. Puzzle Lab. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play.